what is up guys welcome on back to another copart walk around and this has been requested by you guys for a long time it's been a while since i did one i got my stomach prepared we're looking at rvs today Welcome on back guys and today as you can see we're gonna look at some RVs now are we gonna look at these ones first now we just want to show you some of the carnage I think it's hilarious though I was out here last week and it was a genius who bought one of these shits and thought they were gonna hook it up to their truck and just tow it and this shit wasn't gonna fall off I, I ugh. shout out <laughs> Shout out to my dude, Daniel, man, that's out here. They was like, nah, man, you can't do that. You're going to have to get a trailer or something. You can't, no, man. <laughs> wow, we got a lot of toasty out here, man. We got a lot of toasty out here. Holy crap. These RVs are just going up and like mastics. They got a lot of smashed ones out here, too. I'm not used to seeing this many smashed RVs. Look, the bed hanging out. I know you tell me that this couldn't be fixed, but no, this, this could be fixed. You could put this back together. If you got this for pennies on the dot. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm good. Uh, I want to know what hit this. Something came through that windshield at a high velocity, a high rate of speed. Look at, look at the... It's almost like the glass melted. Did this thing get hit by a piece of that Chinese satellite? Did, did a piece of that Chinese space station come down and hit this thing? Oof, they got it up on blocks. So then it must have ran into something. Ooh, wow, this window's busted. Did she roll over? I don't know. Holy crap. Okay. I'm a little interested now. You got my attention. Holy crap, man. I'm afraid to even walk in here for real, for real. Holy, wow. Okay, that's sharp, be careful. Damn, this whole thing is destroyed. Oh, yeah. They rolled this. Had to roll it. Look at this, man. They had to roll this. They had to roll this. Like, you could clean this up, but I just don't see. Like, everything is pulled back from the walls. Yeah, they rolled this. They rolled this sucker. TV busted. Like, couch lifted up. Oh, yeah, no. Nah. Something must have came through the window. Oh, look at this, man. Everything's hanging. This is crazy. Wow. Okay. I've seen enough. What y'all think? I think? I think we've seen enough of this one, right? Jesus. Man. I hope everybody made it out of this one safely. Oh, wow. There we go. Jesus. That's destroyed. All right, let's go on to the next one. Look at this Montana. I see the window right back here is busted. You're missing a wheel on the axle. That window's busted, you rolled it. It's all buckled here, you rolled it. Guarantee you rolled it. Look at this damage right here. Buckled in here, slides out. That window's busted, that window's busted. That window's busted, that, or was it vandalized? Holy crap, man. It'll be interesting to see what the story is with this one. Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, no. Yeah, we're not going to mess with this one, guys. Um, there's no way for me to climb up in there. There's no step, no nothing. And I'm not, uh, 
I'm not feeling that froggy today. Oh, we got a couple of more bigger ones here. This one's a run and drive. The windshield's busted. The front end's been hit. But it's not completely bad. You need whatever covers this whole front piece on the side. A lot of fiberglass work to the front. Looks clean over here. Look at this big giant slide out. This thing turns into a massive house, bro. All right, let's see what we got in here. That's gonna hold my big ass. All right, you know what? I'm gonna grab metal. I like metal. Lots of glass everywhere. Ooh, why does it smell like? Oh, oh, oh. Mm. Excuse me. It just smells like ass in here. Really bad. Straight Bedussi in here, man. Oof. Yeah, this thing is pretty bad, man. Pretty, pretty bad. I wonder if she's got power, though. Let's look. Oh, she's dead. No power. Really nice back here. Oh, I'm trying to let my body get used to the smell. Like the kitchen contain, love the kitchen counters. Love this couch. Hang a lot. The leather couch. Now, see, here's the thing. This whole thing from that wall to down there in the bedroom, this whole thing slides out and it makes this like twice the, twice the width of this bus, basically. And then this thing is amazing. You know what I'm saying? Look at this. You got. Is that a Tempur-Pedic? Is this got the, the sleep number? This is a sleep number bed. Look at the numbers all over it. All right. You got a TV here for the mister if he wants to watch, you know, do his gambling, be, be on his fan duel or whatever. And then you got that one right there. You know, the wife want to watch a little love and hip hop or something. She could do that. You got a full bathroom back there. Look at that. Man, this is not bad. This is, you know, it's damaged outside on the front, but I think this one could be fixed. I really do. I really do. I think this one could be fixed. Let me uh, climb my ass across his bed. Ooh, I don't like broken mirrors, but there it is. Yeah, look at this. Full-size shower. And that window and stuff is open, so there's bugs. The toilet's right there. That's clean, man. That's a nice-sized bathroom, for real, for real. Oh, climb my ass out of here. Ooh. Oh. Oh, nice little fake fireplace. You got a TV here. This is nice, man. All right. Some of the cabinets. Yeah, you would not want to be in here when you got into, ooh, the mirror's on the ground. I ain't messing with that. All right, man. Not bad. Not bad at all. Man, the buns activity over, let me stop. <laughs> Yo, got a nice little counter over here. I can have my laptop here in my chair, do my video editing. This is not bad. I need a bus, though. I thought about it. You know, instead of towing with the Ram, you know, with the Rebel or the TR, I need I need a regular bus or RV and then just put the Chally on the on the trailer behind the, behind the RV. You know what I'm saying? It's not like I don't drive the Chally when I go places to race anyway. You know what I'm saying? So... You know what I'm saying? Did I say it enough times? Did I, you know what I'm saying? All right. Now they have auxiliary batteries. So I'm going to see if there's a, a button here where I can hit the auxiliary battery and um, auxiliary start. There it is. All right. Let's see. Nope. Even the auxiliary batteries are dead. All right. Well, there ain't no jump in this bitch. It is what it is, but huh interesting that windshield is going to be real expensive that fiberglass work on the front is also going to be very expensive but it's not the end of the world and i really think it definitely could be done let me know what you guys think oh dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. climbing my ass down all right I'm not doing this on camera. I'm probably going to eat it. 
Now this is definitely my speed. Somebody was race, put something in here. It could have been a race car. It could have been dirt bikes. It could have been maybe a small cart car or whatever. But you have this section back here, which is kind of like your race trailer, right? And then you go up here into the living area, which is kind of cool, right? Ooh, it's, ooh, someone took a dump in here. Oh my God. Whoo. Mm. 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 <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, so this whole thing slides out. All of this stuff moves. So as the slide out comes out, I'm guessing, wait a minute. the hell I'm trying to figure out how this works I'm going to go outside and see if there's a slide over here because why is this counter right here alright yeah it's got to be this don't move does it huh alright that's weird let me go outside and see how this thing but you got the bedroom up there nice size bed you got a bathroom a shower all that stuff this is a total like weekend hauler for your uh, race team and stuff. Look at that. There's already Kingsford right there. So you can start the grill, boy. Got the extra plug. That's just worth some money by itself. Shits are expensive. Love the ramp. It is a slide out, isn't it? Okay. So the part that's the kitchen with the counter and all that stuff, it probably, when this comes out, it does this. I know that sounds weird to you, but it turns out so that there's a counter and stuff in there. So this comes out. That's just for the kitchen. And then this is up towards the bedroom area. So now we're on the other side of that over here. So yeah, this, this whole section right here. Okay, this whole section right here slides out the stove and all that stuff. And then you have access to all this. That's okay. That's, just, that's what's up. All right. Bedroom has decent room, nice shower. Another slide out here, so the bed actually slides out. Big old shower, though, huh? I mean, big shower for a RV. This is not. This is. This is nice. All right. Is that a bed bug? Oh hell no! Nah. They had bed bugs in here. Ugh. It's really dark in there. All right, I'm getting out of here just because you know it's dead. I saw bed bugs. I'm straight. I am not trying to carry them shits anywhere. Woo! Let me know what you guys think about this weekend warrior RV race hauler in the comments. But interesting. Definitely interesting. All right. Got one with some side damage here. A connect, huh? Any damage anywhere else? Oh, that doesn't look good. <laughs> Yo, your propane tanks melted or caught on fire? Ooh. Let's walk around the rest of the body. She looks okay, at what I can see so far. Spare. Okay, she was near a fire, and that's what did all this. You can see the melts, right? So it's a burn. Yeah, look at the brittle plastic from it being burned. But I don't care about that. That doesn't bother me as long as the interior didn't get damaged from it. I wouldn't too much care. The shower line didn't melt. The cap for the water did, though. But as long as this water thing still turns and I can still... Yeah, man. This other stuff, I'm sure it cracked and did whatever the fiberglass from the heat. But as long as the interior, yeah, this melted too, right? From being near the heat. You know what though? This might not be a bad deal. It could have just been near a fire, like another trailer went up and this was near it. As long as the interior isn't burnt or it didn't breach and cause damage, it might be okay. Oh, wow, this is nice. Oh, this is really nice. Now, 
you would think that there'd be some water damage where that's open, but no, it's good. Look at this bed, man. It like you could. It, it looks like you could just go to sleep in here, bro. For real. The bathroom is like brand new and nice. Hell yeah, man. I'm on board. Look at this. You got the slide out. So this whole thing slides out. You got your TV, your tables. You got a nice full-size refrigerator. I love that. Look, still got the plastic on it. The joint is brand new, man. Microwave, gas stove, some little storage compartments. Yeah, see, this would be me right here. Slide outs. That little TV ain't going to cut it, though. I'd have to get a bigger TV. Like, I'd, I'd delete, like, whatever those cabinets is up there. Give me a big ass TV. You might even hang out some out here and just be like this. Feet up, chilling right here. Sunlight right. Oh man. Hell yeah, man. I wasn't even looking for an RV, but I'm gonna add this one to my watch list. I know, I know I'm gonna pay too much though. Somebody, even though it's crazy, man, people will bid on these, not even come out and look at them. They'll see it's a burn and won't even come look at them and still bid like outrageous prices. It's it's ridiculous. Look at that the toilet and stuff back into the bathroom. It's very small space, but it's a very useful space. And this is light. Like this is something the Ram Rebel or the new Suburban build I got going on. Definitely the Suburban could easily pull this. That 6.2 will be able to pull the shit out of this. And it's just a, it's a pull behind, right? You don't need anything crazy. You hook it up to the hitch and keep it moving, man. And this right here, this will work, man. This will work. Huh? Let me know what you guys think about this one in the comments. All right, guys. The next one we have up is called an I, I Go Evergreen Recreational Vehicles. Looks clean. Almost looks like it's brand new. It should be. It's a 19. I see the tanks down there are unplugged, though. Like the tanks, like the gray water tank is gone. I don't see any damage. What the hell is going on with this bird? He must be injured. There's a pigeon, like he's flying a few feet and then hiding. And maybe he's just hurt and hiding under these RVs, hoping a hawk don't get him. My guess. All right. Pet rescue. Please help our pets. Okay. Well, I'm guessing this is a pet friendly RV. Oh, you got it locked. You're kidding me, right? Yep. Damn. I wanted to see this one. I guess we're not. I guess we're not looking at this one, guys. All right, guys. That's going to do it for the rv walk around i apologize for the wind in advance guys i got no dead cat out here today so i got to work with what i will work with you guys wanted a video on rvs and there you have it